Picture this, in 2024 alone, over 2 million women all over the globe reported getting hit with online blackmail. That number is unfairly high considering the year has not even finished. We need to start talking about the issue. Today, we're diving into how online blackmail affects women and what you can do if you find yourself caught in this mess. Understanding the impact of online blackmail on women Let's get real for a second. Women are getting targeted way more often in these online blackmail schemes. Recent stats show that 70% of victims who came forward about online blackmail in 2024 were women. Many of these ladies have faced years of being exploited and manipulated. It's not just about the fear and anxiety. Some have had their lives flipped upside down. Drop a comment below if you've seen or heard about this happening, whether it's someone you know or even a story you read. Let's start the conversation and support each other. Recognizing the signs of online blackmail Alright, let's get into spotting the signs before things get messy. Here are some red flags to watch out for. Odd friend requests or messages from strangers you've never seen before. Random attempts to dig into your personal information out of nowhere. Out of the blue requests for explicit pictures or videos. Pressure to chat about stuff that gives you bad vibes. Trust your god ladies, if something feels sketchy, it probably is. If you're enjoying these tips, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We've got loads more content on fighting and preventing extortion, plus DIY videos and our brand new podcast series coming your way. Steps to take if you're being blackmailed online. Okay, if you're dealing with online blackmail right now, here is what to do next. 1. Don't engage with a blackmailer, but don't block them either. They're usually pretty cruel when retaliating, even more so when they already have your content. 2. Gather evidence like screenshots of messages and whatever else you can find. 3. Report the incident on the platform where it went down. 4. Reach out to trusted friends or family for support. 5. Connect with organizations that specialize in online harassment and blackmail for some backup. 6. Call the police and file a report. They will escalate it to their cybercrime unit for an investigation. Legal support and resources for women facing blackmail. There are some awesome resources out there ready to help you out. Takeitdown.com They help remove illegal content online. StopNCII.org They've got the tools to remove non-consensual intimate images. IC3 That's the Internet Crime Complaint Center for reporting cybercrimes. NCMEC's Cyber Tip Line Specializes in child exploitation but helps adults too. National Center for Victims of Crime They've got advocacy and resources for victims of crime. Take back the tech. They're all about campaigning against gender-based violence online. Have you ever used any of these resources? Drop a comment and share your experience. Your story could really help someone else out. Our services against sextortion. At Digital Forensics, we're totally here for your situation. We kick things off with an in-depth interview to figure out the best game plan against the criminals. Our tech for IP to location tracking and other cutting edge methods lets us pinpoint those cameras' exact locations and reveal who they are. We tackle anonymity and work to bring those sketchy individuals to light. We'll put in the effort to delete any compromising content you may have shared from all the criminals' devices and accounts to squash the nightmare at its source. At the end of the day, our cease and desist letters will mean you won't hear from them again, but you'll definitely hear back from us. Our comprehensive report will lay out everything we did and all the evidence we gathered for you. We've been crushing it for a decade with a solid 95% success record. Call us at 800-849-6515 or visit digitalforensics.com. We're here with supportive and expert 24-7 assistance. Our initial consultations are totally free. Conclusion Hey, you're stronger than you think. Take action, talk about it, and don't forget that help is always just around the corner. Stay safe and empowered, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for even more videos. I'll see you in the next one. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We have hours of valuable information covering all things extortion related. Be the first to know by subscribing today.